another requested game Xenobat Chronicle Shulk, how are you? Dixon! Right, when did you get back to Colony 9? Dixon. <laughs> Just now. I see you've been busy. Looks like your Monado research has been going well. well I made the right choice leaving you in charge. <laughs> your research notes really helped. So, you can activate it now then. Well, anyone can activate it. The problem is controlling it. Yeah, for everyone except him. Yes. If anyone other than Dunban were able to control the Monado, we could surpass any military force in the world. You think so? What are these hidden functions you mention? It's still only conjecture. But it's starting to look like the Monado might be something far more significant than just a weapon for defeating Mechon. I see. And the evidence to support your theory? It's the symbol that appears in the center when it's activated. What I know is, the central piece is made from multi-layered glass. The symbol appears on the top layer, and each layer is constructed differently. So it's possible that other symbols could appear on different layers. Which means... The Monado might conceal even more power. Am I right? If we could just... unlock the Monado's power...
it's effective against the mech on armor. They say that before time began, it was wielded by the Bionis. The same Bionis that we all live on. It must have a secret. That's how Dunban was able to destroy so many Mekon. And why he lost the use of his right arm. If I can just unlock the secret of its power. Shulk! Fiora? Mm. This is great. It tastes so good. Really? It's amazing. Oh, Shulk. You say that every day. Not quite. Mm. It's always delicious. But today, it's amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. I used some special herbs and spices today. So if you said it was just the same as usual, I'd know for sure you had no sense of taste. What? Ah, oh, nothing. so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Rai. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this, always. batteries can't protect us out here. Let's get back to the lab. Okay. Yeah. 
Ryan? Ryan, what are you doing? Sh sh shulk! Uh, um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just. <laughs> can't cut people. More importantly, what were you thinking, Brian? Sorry, I, I came to ask a favour, but you weren't here. And I saw the Monado, and I know I'm here a lot, but even I need fresh air sometimes. Is your body still feeling numb? We have to be very careful with the Monado. It's not a toy. I know, man. I just wanted to touch it. Didn't know it would do that. Sorry, but is it true the Monado really can't cut people? The pattern in that circle. Or maybe it's a symbol. I think it shows which power the Monado has at the moment. You think it's a symbol? Well, if I can find a way to increase the number of symbols, I should. I'm sure that's all very clever. But why were you more worried about a machine than me, Shulk? Well, I just... I just explained why. That's not the point! Uh, s sorry. <sighs> just now. I don't mean that. A feeling like time had stopped, and then time had stopped. So, was it only me who saw that? That sounds strange. Is it another Monado thing? Who knows? Anyway, no matter how good a sword it is, that's what happens when you hold it. Looks like Dundan really is the only one who can use it. I won't let my brother use it ever again. Not after what it did to him. Oh. Sorry. I, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, the point is, I'm fine. To be honest, this has happened a few times before. I've been researching the Monado for a long time. Shulk, don't act as if this is nothing. Look, don't worry about it. Anyway, Ryan, what did you want to ask me about? Ah, uh, yeah, uh, old Square Tash is gonna put me on punishment duty. Fancy taking along? Punishment? The Colonel was pretty angry today. Did he hit you? Well, whether he hit me is neither here nor there, really. 
Although, actually, he did end up hitting me. And that ain't all. He made me do a thousand squats and sit-ups. <laughs> nasty. Yeah. And now I have to go all the way to the Magmel ruins and back. So you have to go and collect the ether cylinders. That's the one. They're used to power the mobile artillery. Looks like the damage has been repaired. They can't move without the ether energy. And it seems like the fueling station's all out of stock. Is the mobile artillery that big machine that crashed in the residential district? Yeah, probably. You know your way around there, right? Yeah. OK, I'll go with you. Yeah, knew you would. Hold on. The Magmel ruins are in Tefra Cave, right? I heard that there's a male lizard nest there. I couldn't take it if anything happened to Shulk. He's delicate. Not like you, Ryan. What are you on about? I'll be fine. I can take care of myself. But... OK, I got it. I'll make you a promise. Shulk won't even get a scratch. A promise doesn't mean much coming from you. <laughs> she don't trust me at all. Nah, she doesn't mean it. She doesn't mean it. Come on, let's go! Come on, bro! Run faster! Oh. Ah! Oh! Come on, bro. Run faster. Keep up 
Jokers. You forgot something? You will be needing the transport cases, right? Fiora. <gasps> ah! I'm coming along as well. I'd feel better going with you boys than sitting at home worrying about you. So, let's get uh -huh. moving. She's all awesome. <laughs> I knew she didn't trust me. <laughs> Looks like it.
During the fighting it lag Okay, let's fight. That's what I'm 
talking about. Help me protect Shulk. Magmel ruins. Haven't you been here before? Nope. The defense force often uses it for training. But I come here to do research. It's not really a place that people go. Not surprising. There are monsters around here that use Mechon parts as armor. Monsters. Was this built by the Mechon? I don't think so. There's a path for people to get in. It might have been a vehicle of some kind. Like the defense force hover transport. A vehicle? But it's so big. It's amazing technology. I wonder what kind of people made it. I ain't got a clue. Let's keep moving. The ether cylinders are up ahead. Right. Run. Eh. Ah. 
them up. You two hold on a sec. It's full of ether cylinders. Hey, why do we have to come all the way here to get them? Isn't there an ether cylinder fueling station in the colony? Well, refining the ether takes a long time down there, and sometimes cylinderization fails. 
And there are so many cylinders here for us already. It's more reliable than making them ourselves. Right. And Colony 9's anti-air batteries and mobile artillery are standardized for these cylinders. So they can be used straight away. I see. You know, this place is in good condition considering it's ancient. It might be that there's some form of technology being used to preserve it. It's just a shame we don't understand its secret. Shulk? But I'll solve it one day and show you. If it's just technology that someone created in the past, it's not incomprehensible. We'll come to understand it one day. Don't go trying too hard. We can come and get ether cylinders whenever we need them. Besides, it's a good place for Defence Force training. Yeah, so good that you didn't even want to come here without Shulk to back you up. Anyway, did you collect the cylinders? Yep, all done. Thanks. Just come by yourself from now on. Shh, be quiet. This emulated CPU clock speed that depend on your CPU for SD845 is around 100 for the lower end reduce it open GL six p on 720 is okay also on 1080 the full HD it's like the rest default Heck also default, don't disturb any of it. Paco F1. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching.